Hey guys, welcome back to the final part of the main quest of Oblivion. Yeah, shut up. Yeah, I came here to the Imperial City Palace off screen. Alright, let's talk to Chancellor Ricardo. What? <laughs> His audio just cut Martin out. <laughs> Septim, on behalf of the Elder Council, I accept your claim to the Imperial Throne. We should arrange the coronation ceremony as Chancellor soon as. What? Chancellor oh dear, what's this? Chancellor Where is he? Oh, there he is. The city is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened, and Daedra are inside the walls. Oops. The guard is good. overwhelmed. Courage, soldier. We have an emperor again. Your Highness, what are your orders? Shall the guard fall back to the palace? No. If we let ourselves get besieged in the palace, we're doomed. We must get to the Temple of the One immediately. As you command, sire. Guards, form up and protect the emperor. All right, we get to fight our way to the Temple of the One. Oh, oh, and Daedra are inside the palace already. Oops, I just hit Martin, but he was lucky. Oh, so I just damaged my own weapon. Yeah, the nice thing is, you got all the palace guards fighting with you, and you've got Chancellor Okado, who is a really good mage. Like, really good, and he can just blast through pretty much anything. And you've got Martin, who's pretty good with fighting. Right, let's do this. Go. Yeah, this is gonna be nasty. I'm probably gonna get like swarmed by clan fear, something like that. Just you wait. I'll get swarmed. Oh look, clan fear and kinval. Ow. Okay, darn. <laughs> yeah, I get to level up. Okay, darn. Oh, God, just so- Ow! So many days left. Where's my backup? You. Oh, God, and it's lagging because there's so many enemies. <laughs> See, this is what I hate about fighting clan here. Like, they just- They hit you so much and they just make you stumble every time so you can't- can die. 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 Heal, and then die. Oh, you die. Oh, ow. Right. Boom! Okay, yes! Ow! Oh, not terrible. Oh god, I'm being swarmed! Clan fear! I hate clan fear! Oh god, it's real! Oh, oh no, I'm gonna die! Oh! Heal! Oh. Look at this! I can't move! I keep stumbling! I can't freaking move! Oh, there we go. Here, ow! Oof! Jeez, are you seeing this? I can't- I'm stumbling. I can't freaking fight. You know, ow. Ow, ow. Die. Heal. Heal. Where, where the hell is everybody? Where's Martin and, and Okada and where are all the soldiers? Did they- No, they can't have died, because if Martin died, the game would be over. Okay, where are they? Where is everyone? The Legion soldiers who came to help me outside are dead, but where are the... Oh... They didn't go on, did they? No. Oh, you know where they are. They're, they're probably still in the palace. I left before them, so... <laughs> oh, God. No wonder I was getting destroyed. We didn't have half our forces with us. The little legion soldiers outside are the only ones who were helping me. Everyone else was inside. Ugh. Still, at least now we can face the next part with a full force. Usually half of those guys die. So we have Okado, Martin, and all the soldiers are following. Cool. Cool deal. No wonder I was getting destroyed. It's because half of our men weren't there. <laughs> and also, we can change from an to another sword, because the sword wasn't doing anything against those Daedra. There we go. Alright, let's do this. This is the final charge. This ends here and now, in this video. The main quest, not the whole let's play. Relax. <laughs> oh, there's oblivion gates everywhere. Okay, don't bother trying to fight them all. I'm just gonna attack that guy because he's going for Martin. Kill the ones that go for Martin, basically. That's all you have to do. And you just run. Like, there's just so many that you... You can't fight them all. You know, you know whatever. Oh crap! Oh, he's a big one. We're too late. Mayroon's Dagon is here. Oh crap! Lighting the dragon fires will no longer save us. 
The barriers that protected us from oblivion are gone. Hey, you got a frozen Dramora right next to you. I don't see how. Mortal weapons may hurt him, but now that he is physically here in Tamriel, they have no power to actually destroy him. Oops. Wait, yes. The amulet was given to mortals by Akatosh. It contains his divine power. But how to use this power against Dagon? The amulet was not intended as a weapon. I have an idea, one last hope. I must reach the Dragonfires and the Temple of the One. You'll just have to trust me. I know now what I was born to do, but I'll need your help. I have to get past Mehrun's Dagon somehow. Then I'll do the rest. Lead on, my friend. So the thing about your plans, I Martin, is that they usually end up with me going in, going up against impossible odds, and I usually get screwed while you sit around and do nothing. You now I got two Dramora, oh man. I gotta kill these two Dramora, so otherwise I'm gonna chase you. Duh. Well, that was nice. Oh, he already had low health. Ow. Hey, Martin, you wanna help? Maybe? You wanna help me? Ow. Oh, see, so he gets attacked, so now he starts doing so. Uh, die. There you go. Oh god, and you got a freaking climb here. Oh wow, bloody hell, Martin. Alright, the thing, do not fight Mehrun's Dagon. You cannot kill him. Unless you use console commands, and that's the PC. So just run past him, he won't get you. Like, he, he moves so freaking slow that he won't get you. Just run into the temple, and Martin will be right behind you. Right? Yeah, there he is. Alright, this is it. Final scene. Martin's plan is going to end up getting me screwed somehow, probably. I do what I must do. I cannot stay to rebuild Tamriel. That task falls to others. Farewell. You've been a good friend in the short time that I've known you. But now I must go. The dragon waits. The dragon waits. Hmm. I'm going to have to fight a freaking dragon. Oh, crap. Oh. Don't worry, Martin. I think you can take him. Oh. Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, this is epic. Big golden dragon versus big red forearm thing. Yeah, whatever. Shut up, I'm not feeling creative today. Stick you right there. Hacks you with the axe. Ooh, dragon's getting killed. Yeah, yeah, use fire against the, against the demon lord. Yeah. I think probably made of our Oh, but yeah, bite him in the neck, that works too. And finish him off with that spiritual fire thing as well. Sends him back to the world. And Merun's Dagon is gone. Oh, but what's the dragon doing? And the final throws. And of course, Akata walks in right as the battle's over. Of course. The amulet is shattered. Dagon is defeated. With the dragon's blood and the amulet of kings, we have sealed the gates of oblivion. Forever. The last of the Septims passes now into history. I go gladly, for I know my sacrifice is not in vain. I take my place with my father, and my father's fathers. The third age has ended, and a new age dawns. When the next Elder Scroll is written, you shall be its scribe. The shape of the future, the fate of the Empire. These things, now, belong to you. Cool. Hey, Ricardo, a lot of help you were. What happened? Where's Martin? I must congratulate him. Mehrun's Dagon is defeated. Cast back into oblivion. We've won! Well, you know that big dragon you just saw? What do you mean? Gone? We saw the temple dome explode. The avatar of Akatosh appear. That was Martin? Yep. The joined blood of kings and gods. The amulet of kings. The divine power of Akatosh. Then, Martin is gone. Yes, sealed forever. Merun's Dagon and his ilk 
can never threaten Tamriel again. Martin is dead, but he died an emperor and a hero to rival Tiber Septim. This victory is not without cost. We've lost Martin Septim. What an emperor he might have made. His sacrifice was necessary, but it leaves the empire without an emperor. I don't know what happens now. There are troubled times ahead for the empire. But now is not the time to worry about the future. Let's just give thanks that we're alive. In my capacity as Lord High Chancellor of the Elder Council, I hereby proclaim you Champion of Cyrodiil. And as a small token of gratitude for your service to the Empire, I have ordered a suit of Imperial Dragon armor made for you. Imperial Dragon armor is normally worn only by the Emperor himself. But you deserve no less, champion. The dragon will stand forever as a memorial to what you and Martin did for all of Tamriel. Yep. So the dragon will be here for the rest of the game. And I think... Oh no. If you come back later, you can activate the statue and it gives you like a blessing. Well, anyway, that is the, um, that's the main quest line. Yeah, that dragon will be here for the rest of the game. I never actually went to the Imperial City on screen, did I? Oh, wait, yeah, of course I did the quest in the sewers with Boris. Well, anyway, um, oh, poor Boris. He died at Bruma. Yeah, if Joffrey and Boris had survived the Battle of Bruma, they would both be here, but, unfortunately, they didn't. So, Jo... The uh, Okado goes back to the council chambers, and, um, that's pretty much it. Yeah, I never really liked the ending to the main quest, just because it seemed so uncertain. That aura, it left you with a feeling of hopelessness, as opposed to a feeling of satisfaction that you beat the main quest. But still, relax, this is not the end of the Let's Play. Um, I will continue, I'll do all the guilds, I will do the Knights of the Nine, and I will do the Shivering Isles. It's the Shivering Isles right there. I'll probably do the Shivering Isles last, just because it's like another big main quest and I want it to be safe for last. It's kind of like special. And anyway, that's uh, pretty much it. Is anything I can do, Shut I'm up! I'm trying, to, I'm trying to close here. Anyway, that's it, and I will see you next time.